Hi, hello, and welcome back to Rebel Unicorn Crafts. We're day two of the 12 days of fluid painting tips and tricks to help improve your practice. Today is more of a simple tip, and it's how you can possibly save some money and reuse your supplies so that you're also not wasting quite as much. Fluid painting can be quite an expensive hobby, so if you can figure out the things that you can reuse within this hobby, you can save yourself quite a bit of money. In my personal practice, I reuse the following things. Cups, especially I got some special actual reusable cups instead of just the disposable ones. They do seem to be easier to clean out. Extra tip for actually cleaning these, it's recommended that when you put water in to get the paint out that you dump it somewhere on your grass so it'll help filter out any of the things so they don't go into the water supply. But they're pretty easy to clean out. You can use sometimes use silicone spray on them to make them even easier. I don't personally like to do that because I don't like to use silicone in my paintings, but I digress. The second are my tongue depressors. These you can even just let dry and just or wipe them off and as long as there's not wet paint on them they're perfectly fine to reuse again and again. Pipettes. These plastic pipettes are great and they last forever so reuse those as many times as possible. My favorite thing to reuse are canvases. And this can be everything from pores that didn't turn out how you wanted them to, it happens, to old artwork that you had on your walls that maybe you did at a paint and sip night, friends who might be remodeling ask for their old canvases, reuse those canvases time and time again. And the best way to do this is to put a quick layer of gesso down. You can also just use some white paint, but gesso is going to help things adhere a little better and it has a fuller coverage so you don't have to do as many layers to actually cover the old canvas up. All right, happy painting and reusing. Come back tomorrow for day three. I hope that you have a magically creative day. If you want to share any other tips with me or let me know what you reuse in the comments below, please do. Or let me know on any of my Instagrams at Rebel Unicorn Crafts at Lacey Walker Art.